Hey guys, so I am back with another unboxing video and as you can tell from the thumbnail and the title I will be opening Geek Gear Wizardry's April box. Now if you're wondering why I'm opening the April box at the very end of May, simply put I got super duper sick. I could not speak more than 10 words without having a coughing fit. So the box has sat unopened and ignored so that way I could do it on camera and make a video out of it as soon as I started feeling better. So I am finally on the mend and I want to open this so bad they've already sent the shipping notification for the next box and I'm still holding on to this one. So I was able to avoid any kind of spoilers, I have no idea what's inside. I'm actually really just kind of hoping they included some more of those sherbet lemons because they were so good. I still have a couple from last month's box. I've been kind of trying to save them because they're amazing so I'm really really hoping that there's some more in here. Everything else would honestly just be a bonus as long as the candy's in there. But you know what now that I've said something it's probably not. But let's check it out. So ooh, ow, I hit myself in the mouth with the corner. Okay so it's hidden by some recyclable packing stuff and that's something I really like is that the packing is eco-friendly um, and recyclable as I already said. But I can already see quite a few, I'm hitting my window, little things in here. So let's just grab the first thing. So the very first thing is the tea, and this is liquid luck tea. Now I did not drink the last tea, I actually um, just gave it to a friend who does drink tea. But I feel like I want to actually try this one because it says it's black tea, sweet nut brittle pieces, hazelnuts and sugar cocoa nibs flavoring and vanilla flavoring so that actually sounds really really good to me so I think I am gonna give this one a try the next little package is from our magical treats and this is a butterscotch beer fudge so it's you know sugar glucose all of that fudge essentially um, let me open it up now that I know there was like fudge in here <laughs> I probably should have opened this box sooner but fudge keeps for a while I just feel like I'm lucky I didn't get ants <laughs> So, let's see, um, it doesn't smell like anything, I'm trying to take a little piece out of here to show you guys, there we go, oh it's cute, okay, that's a weird thing to say, but it is this uh, two-toned, lighter color fudge, it has a very soft smell. I guess I'm I'm used to South Texas fudge that's like super sweet and just thick and really, really rich. But I'll give this a try. I, I can't say if I'll like it or not, but my sister loves fudge. So if I'm not a fan, I know that she probably will be. The next box is this really tiny one. It says liquid luck on it. One sip and you'll find that all your endeavors succeed. Ooh, I could use some of this. And then on the back, on the back it says fragile not a toy as I almost drop it let's open it up <gasps> how cute wow it really looks like it so there is this really awesome and I'll do close-up shots of course like I did really awesome vial with um, a little metal I think it's metal or at least plastic of some kind a liquid luck label on it and it's filled with golden glitter that's really, really nice. I love that. The next small thing in there is a necklace and it has a small little H charm and then a lightning bolt charm and the packaging is so cute. It has Harry's glasses, the elder wand, the sorting hat, the acceptance letter, and it says you're a wizard along the bottom. I obviously love um, necklaces and jewelry in general, mostly necklaces, so this is absolutely perfect. I have about four Harry Potter themed necklaces already, so this will fit right in. So excitingly, the next package seems to actually be a wand. Now I know that they do wands because when they were having their sale, I did buy the one that had the raven head, and it's really nice quality. I didn't expect them to include it in the, this subscription box because the wands are their own subscription box, but that's pretty cool. So it's the Nathair wand. Nat hair? I'm gonna say Nathair, I like that more. So the Nathair wand, the length is 13 and a half inches. The core is snake scale, and the wood type is black ash. And it comes with this little cool card that's taped on. So let's see if I can remove it without ruining it. <gasps> no, I'm ruining it. <laughs> okay. 
uh, it's separating here at the edge where the tape is. So I think I'm just gonna leave the tape on and I'll cut that off. But let's actually take the wand out and look at it. So it's just wrapped in this little packing paper with a bit of bubble wrap, it seems. <gasps> this is so cool! <gasps> oh, my Slytherin heart be still. Look at this. It is, okay, so it looks like wood, obviously. Um, it has the notches and stuff for wood in it. And then there is a green and brown snake that coils up the wand and its head is here at the base. That is so awesome. I mean, I did not expect them to include a wand, but the fact that they did and the fact that it is this one, oh my God. This is definitely my favorite thing out of the whole box for sure and I'm not even done. Okay, I'm gonna put the wand aside. We're gonna look at what else is in there before I get too carried away waving that around and blind myself or break my glasses. <laughs> Okay guys, so we are almost done with the box. There are only two items left. The second to last item is the t-shirt. It is so soft. It's in this dark gray color. And look at this. This is so awesome. I can already tell you I love this box a thousand times more than the last box. This one is completely up my alley. So it has two snakes one on either side here in silver and again I'll do a close-up so you can see it better but with a gold accent in the center of Bellatrix um, Death Eater mask like it's just the outline like the kind of detailing mark so there's no real harsh lines of anything there's little cobwebs in the back some a bone X there at the bottom this is so cool oh my god look at that I I love this. I love this shirt. This shirt is awesome. All right. We have one more thing. We have the print and we have the scratch off. So we're going to check those out. So this print, I know I keep using the word awesome. This print is amazing. Look at this. So it is pretty much a printout. Well, a print, obviously. It is all of the different wands, starting with Albus Dumbledore at the top and going all the way down to Bellatrix Lestrange there at the bottom. Features Snape, Voldemort, Luna, Minerva McGonagall, Jenny Weasley, Neville Longbottom, Ronald Weasley, Hermione Granger, and Harry Potter himself. This is so cool and then it has the scrolling here at the top that says the wand chooses the wizard harry potter there at the bottom and then just a lot of kind of accenting around the edges and stuff it makes me reminiscent of my trip and ollivanders and their displays there this is just if you can't own all of the wands this is a fantastic substitute wow very very impressed so before I check out my scratch off to see if I won anything, my Packed With Care slip has Leslie on it. So thank you, Leslie, and your absolutely adorable dog. This is a fantastic photo. I love me some cute dogs. Now I do have my scratch card. So let's see if I won anything. I'm just using my fingernail because I don't actually have anything. Nope, didn't win this month, didn't win last month either. Will I ever win? I don't know. So of course we have our little letter and this is the printout of everything that is inside. Let's see if I can not ruin this one like I ruined the last one. That's not too bad, pretty clean break. Okay, a massive thank you from all of us at Geek Gear for subscribing to the Geek Gear Wizardry box. We hope you enjoy every single item that we have carefully packed into your box this month and that you continue your subscription and remain to be a valued member of the ever-growing Geek Gear community. April 2019, oh my god, okay, so, oh wow, okay, so April 2019, the exclusive Dark Arts t-shirt, which is awesome, the exclusive Unique Wand, which is the Nathair Wand, which is awesome. The exclusive Liquid Luck Tea, which I haven't tried, so I don't know if it's awesome, but it sounds really good. The exclusive Wizardry Necklace, which is super cute, and I love it. Exclusive Butterscotch Fudge. Don't know if it's good yet. Sounds pretty good, but will definitely get eaten, even if I'm not the one to eat it. The exclusive Replica Liquid Luck Vial. Very cute touch. I absolutely love the design of that vial and the logo is not just like a sticker, like it's 
the detail is great on that, even for something so small. And then of course, the exclusive license, the Wands chooses the wizard print. And it's designed by Pyramid International, I think I read that right. So the reason I'm laughing so much, um, so next month's box is Hagrid themed, but they put a YouTube spotlight on the bottom and it's me this time. <laughs> I didn't even think that they would have seen my video, so thank you guys for putting me. Thank you for including me. I love how you can see my little Moogle and the pictures of my friends behind me. I should probably use a different backdrop, but that's a nice screenshot of me, I guess. So yeah, Geek Gear, if you're watching this, uh, Leslie, yeah, Leslie, if you're watching this, thank you for packing my box. I really, really loved this month. I look forward to getting next month's. I love Hagrid, so I'm excited. I wish I hadn't waited so long to open it. I absolutely could have used all of these items by now, but yeah, so this was definitely something to look forward to now that I'm finally feeling better. I really appreciate all of the care that went into the box. I'm excited to get next month's. So thank you guys over at Geek Gear. Um, for making an awesome product. I'm happy to be subscribed. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what your favorite item out of the box is, and I will see you in the next one.